in election after election after 2014 the bjp has won more elections than it has lost both at the union and the state government levels the question is why do so many people cutting across divisions of caste gender and religion vote for a party with an unapologetically aggressive hindutva politics is it because of the massively publicized social welfare schemes whatever their flaws are they the big pulling factor or is it because of a massive mobilization of rss cadre i have spent 20 years tracking the bjp and narendra modi and what i've put together now is a revisionist account of the world's largest political party how it rose how it became what it became and how it changed the indian polity it goes beyond the usual narrative of hindutva politics to show how the bjp reshaped the indian polity under narendra modi with its own unique brand of social engineering it shows how it built new caste coalitions made the claim of a new welfare state powering marginalized groups and the making of a new women's vote this book is built on insights from three new indices the mehta singh social index which examines the caste of indian politicians going back across the last 30 years the narad index which examines communication patterns across political parties going back the last 15 years and the poll niti which is a unique database bringing together hundreds of varying indices across politics and economics to give us startling new insights into the underside of india's politics and its economy access to previously untapped historical archives which have never been seen before exclusive interviews with a range of political leaders across the spectrum and reportage from across the country is the basis and the bedrock of this book which informs a new understanding of the bjp and the shape of india's politics you will be surprised at what this comes up with at a time when social media is rent apart with the echo chambers of the left and the right this is a non partisan account that must be read by all sides of the political divide that's the only way we can really understand what's really happening in this country of ours